Hey there, Slavis here, back with another episode of Dark Cloud. In the last episode we saved Claude, got his house all the way put together, and we upgraded our bone rapier with the power of our synthesized dagger. Now we're gonna venture on through the Divine Beast Cave. There's only one Atla on this floor, so I'm thinking something's gonna happen. We'll, we'll have to find out. Oh yeah, we got another event. Well done making it here. I had a good look at your ability. Or maybe it was just that stone on your left arm. No doubt, that is the legendary Atlamelia, a treasure from the gods that only the worthy can possess. Hard to believe that you are worthy of it, but that's not the issue here. Would you be so kind as to hand it over to me? I see. So you intend to use that stone to restore the world. A noble goal. But even if you restore the world, the destruction could repeat itself. Unless you defeat the Dark Genie. Unfortunately, such a task is beyond your abilities. It is a being powerful enough to destroy the world in an instant. No weapon or man can stand and face it alone. I've come to this place, or rather this time, for that stone. I need that stone, more than you do, actually. There's a great deal about that stone that you don't comprehend yet. Ugh. Uh. Pardon me, I do ramble on sometimes. Well, if you will not hand over the stone willingly, then I have no choice. Let's see what you can do, as the one supposedly entitled to the stone. Oh, we got a duel. Damn it. Must get perfect on everything. Oh, wait. Oh yeah, yeah. Continue where I left off. Ow. Yeah, good job. A present from the fairies of Terra. And we got an amethyst. <laughs> you did quite well. How's this then? Cat. You amuse me, boy. You can't even handle an attack as meager as this. You cannot be worthy of the stone. <laughs> it's not that you couldn't dodge, you simply didn't dodge. Deliberately. Fine then. That's it for today. I think I'm beginning to see why the fairies chose you. It will be amusing to see how well you do. I will offer you some free information, though. You cannot defeat the Dark Genie even with the stone. Not yet. If you have become a, if you have even a vague desire to defeat it, you must become stronger. Oh, I almost forgot. I have a gift for you. Have that little one return you the favor. See you soon. We got a thing. Oh, a changing potion.
right, so we we won won that duel, I guess. Stray cat has been acquired. Now there's a. How do I get across this? Can I get across this yet? No, I can't. There's a treasure over there. Oh, that's right. Okay. Cohen cannot jump this. Well, that's too bad. We're gonna have to back out of this dungeon for now. No sign of monsters, so we can just connect with the fairy guy. And we got a stray cat. So where could that go? Boom. It goes to Towen's house. So let's see what kind of event can go on in here. Oh, good, you came just in time. Look! A little kitty cat wandered in here. Towen, let's give this kitty a name, alright? Zhao works. Zhao, that's a good name. Your name is Zhao. Hi, Zhao. All right, so there's some treasure in here, some repair powder. What else we got? Nothing. Got a cat. The eyes want to tell something. Use item with square. Well. Let's go ahead and use that item that that guy gave us. Changing potion. Changes animal to human. Well, that could be pretty useful. Magic cat. What? What's this? Whoa, I'm like totally a human. Wow, how'd you do it, Master? Are you a wizard? Oh, well, never mind. Well, anyways, Zhao wants to help Master with the adventure. Please, can I? Please, please, please? Say yes, say yes. Does not appear like I have a choice. Zhao is now an ally. Oh, is that a new friend? I haven't seen her around here. Alright, so we have an ally now. And that will be very useful. Let's go ahead and uh, look at our allies tab. Looks like we can have quite a few allies. Zhao, cat transformed with change potion. She has only one defense, so she's kind of squishy. Let's take a look at our weapons. Wooden slingshot. Well, that makes sense. She's got a. She has no. like, barely any defense, so she should probably stay back. Alright, I'm gonna see if there's anything new at the shop here. Then we'll head into the dungeon and try out our new ally's power. Alright, so we're back here. Cohen can't jump this. Let's see if our cat-like friend can. Yes, perfect. There's Dran's crest. Oops. Here. Ah. <laughs> Broke the slingshot. Alright, so I think we're gonna go into the next floor, and I think the next floor is actually a limiting zone where we can only use Zhao. No, it's not. But those types of floors do exist. Whoa. Statue. 
Oh, one damage. Well, I'm not fighting the statue like that. Actually, I wonder if we can upgrade her weapon. Do more damage to that thing. Does not appear so, so. Actually, I think we can switch immediately after that. Nope. Nobody got the ABS for that. But anyways, what we can do is we can weaken an enemy with Toei. Finish the enemy with Xiao. Um, and then just gain some ABS from that. Too bad. Eh. <gasps> no. that statue dog go back into that mode. It, yeah. Okay, next time I'm back in town, I'm gonna buy a couple of those auto repair just for situations like that. Damn. I'm like so destroyed right now. We got three Atla in this room. First one is trees. Second one is small windmill two. And the third one is small windmill three. All right. Let's go ahead and back out of the dungeon and see what we can build back home. All right, so we got Laura's house. We also got Carl, Allnit's baby brother. Okay, so Coral isn't used in anything. Let's uh, put this lamp here. Laura's house can go maybe right, right there. Looks fine. Board. Root of Eden. This, I think those two items are really good. Increases max value of thirst meter. Does that work for both characters? No. Well, we'll use Toe and more, so that would make sense to use it on him. Root of Eden. Increase max health. Well, Zhao isn't going to get hurt as much. I'm going to use that on Toe and as well. Alright, I hope Zhao doesn't get hurt as much. Alright, so I bought some auto repair powders. Um, I'm gonna try not to use them. I'm gonna keep them only for emergencies. So, we'll, uh... See what happens with that. And anyways, we didn't, uh... Oh, hey, there's an item here. Fish candy. That's for Zhao. I think that increases her defense. Yeah. Wow. Increased by seven. So now she has the same amount of defense as Toen. Well, I'm kind of glad I didn't give her that uh, Fruit of Eden then. Let's see if there's anything in Laura's house. But we have no, nothing other than Laura's house. Um, in here, I guess. 
So, just some tasty water. Still pretty useful. Oh, we also got the other windmills. Go ahead and place those. Alright, so I think that's where I'm going to end this episode. Um, we got a new ally, and we broke our best sword. But we learned a, a pretty good lesson regarding auto repair powder. So, yeah. That was my favorite sword. But anyways, thank you for watching, and hope you join me in the next episode. See ya.